Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Yu-Gi-Oh! 2008. It's me, Cooper, and today, my, uh, work with Chaz continues. We still have to duel these two guys, oh god. I've been trying to get our five wins on everybody. It's been a tough, tough road. But we are working our butts off, and we are doing pretty decently. The Law of Light versus Scissors, haha, <laughs> oh shit. How about Rock? They're cheaters. I don't care what anyone says, they cheated. Ah, going forth. One of the weakest things that could happen to me. So, let's see what happens. What kind of hand do I have? A hand that uh, could benefit from going forth if my opponent leaves me a monster. Because then I can Jinzo and not have to worry about their traps. You know what? Stamping Destruction on both cards would be smart. A thousand burn for that. I think that's alright. Yep. Keep it, keep it going. We're lucky they didn't chain that. Yep, good job. Alright, now Rush Recklessly and Dust Tornado should be enough to protect us. Uh, okay. Well, who needs protection when we can use Destruction? So, Dust Tornado should be enough to protect us, and they will not be able to Tribute unless they get their Field Spell. So, we're, we're good for now. We are good for now. Let's see what happens. Double Cost On is there for Tribute, but we will survive thanks to Mass Dragon's Effect. In fact, we're going to do better than survive. We're going to get to Arm Dragon level 5. And as long as I have some spell trap destruction, we'll be able to take down whatever they got. Problem is, he's got a dust tornado and he probably won't activate it. So, Oh, he did! Good job, Chaz! Okay, double my body of his, uh, as a shield is gone. Now I can draw. Sadly, I already had my level 5 in my hands, so that's just kind of a thing. Yeah, we are going to get Arm Dragon level 5. Arm Dragon level 5 is happy to be here. We are now going to go in all in. We're going to summon Mass Dragon. We have every card we need. So Arm Dragon level 5 go. We're going to attack Double Cost On. Double Cost On is going down. And now that Double Cost On has fallen, we are going to go over to Mass Dragon. We're going to do 1400 damage. We have two safe monsters. Sadly, I have no back row for my buddy here. But the good news is um, we've destroyed most of their spells and traps. And I got us to Arm Dragon level 7. So, good teamwork between me and him to get out his boss monster. We'll see if I draw my boss monster. It's all luck based here. That's fine, I had Mass Dragon for that. That's fine, Arm Dragon level 7 is too powerful for anything they've got. I still stand by what I said. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh shit, they had one set. Please get your last stamping destruction, I don't trust them. All right, well, we're gonna... Oh, yeah, use their mausoleum. I like that. Now, if it's T... No! Why? Chaz! Why would you do this? We had everything. We had everything we needed. You... D oh, my God. There is no way they had more defense than 28 in any sense of the word. We are ourselves a double tribute monster. There's no reason not to attack. I don't care if that trap was Saku. We should at least attempt to win. Instead of whatever the hell you just did. Oh no, I won't be able to pull off freaking... Unless the big one attacks me, I won't. All my effects are negate. I hate Chaz. We had the game. Like, obviously if that trap is like Saku, then we did not have the game. But we'll never know. We should have had the game. Nothing I could summon matters. Not unless they attack me with the vanity right now. Oh, they did. Okay, so I get a new hand. We're not going to make it to my turn, but... Hey, maybe I run Karibo. I don't run Karibo. Holy shit, Chaz. We had everything we needed. We set up everything. All you had to do was attack. All you had to do was attack. You had one job. I have a brand new hand. If you could somehow make it to my turn, you idiot. Well, then we'll be fine. We lose. Yo, oh my god. Oh, fuck me. I can't believe this. I hate this. The tag duels are the worst. Like, as some people are like, yeah, it's kind of like dueling 2v1. Some people are like, nah, it's more like 2.5v1 uh, 2 because your opponent's against you. No, it's a full-on 3v1. No matter what anybody says, you're fighting three duelists at the same time. And one of them controls your cards. It's just, it's, it's, it might as well be a 4v1. Because that third person controls your side of the field. Like, holy crap, that is the worst. 
And like I said, maybe that trap card was a trap that could have killed our monsters. Maybe. But who cares? You have to go in. You have to. Okay, well, that is upsetting. Obviously, I am upset. I believe I am justified to be upset. If any of you guys think I am not justified, then go ahead and tell me why. But, um, yeah, no, I'm justified. I don't care. Actually, I will I'll ignore your comment anyway. <laughs> I, I, I'm upset. I deserve to be upset. That was terrible. This is why I need to go first so that stuff doesn't happen. That way I have the best po uh, monsters on our turn. Oh, I can't believe he did that. No, this hand is actually really good. Even for going fourth, it'll be okay. It's not the best of, unless he sets me up. Uh, he runs two a Sir Priest? God damn it. At least set a Sir Priest. I hate that the AI doesn't even set it. Oh god, Chazzy boy. You, you should have... Uh, it's fine. Well, at least we did 1500 burn. How about that? I'll set us up, Chaz, since you don't seem to be capable. Oh boy. Oh yeah. Alright, Dust Tornado was good there. We do not want them to throw away cards. Drillroid's gonna hurt. Drillroid's gonna counter Mass Dragon, so now I have to play it in attack mode. But it should work out. It sucks, but it should work out. Let's see if this guy has any traps for us. Okay. Good, I can pop those. I'm gonna draw a card. Um, you know what? Because the AI played stupid, now I'm gonna do something kind of stupid. Yeah, I wasn't gonna try and kill you this turn anyway. Uh, no, none of that matters. Yeah, I'm gonna do something kind of stupid, so get ready. We hit Saku at least. I'm gonna use my Gold Sarcophagus, but I'm gonna use it on my boss monster. Because I'm gonna believe that somehow Chaz won't mess this up. And I'm gonna be able to summon Arm Dragon level 10. I summon you in attack mode, and I'm gonna leave a spell card to make it look like I'm baiting. And then we'll see if I'm actually baiting or not. As long as they don't get like a blowback dragon or something, and we're, then we're fine. Good, they're just gonna go in. And since Drillroid attacked, I can put the next one in defense mode. So that's nice. Alright, I actually save life points by doing what I just did. Uh, I only own two Mass Dragons, I forgot about that. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I 100% forgot that I own two Mass Dragons. Mechanical Chaser goes in, and now I've set up for my buddy here. And he has an Arm Dragon level 5 in his hand, so what he could do is he could Special Summon from the deck, one of his Arm Dragon level 5s, use the one in his hand to pop Mechanical Chaser or Drillroid, and then um, attack the other one to get into his final form. Perfect, I'll do it. Chaz, I'm not gonna screw you over. We're gonna make sure this works, let's see. Eh, we weren't going to be in defense mode, so it's fine. Chazzy boy, do it. From your deck, not from your hand. Perfect. Use your hand now. Use the Sir Priest. But we don't want to leave them a tribute, Chaz. We know they have Blowback Dragon. This is why I'm asking you to use your effect. Uh, no other reason. Okay, well, he can't use that kind of thinking. But we get to see the animation. We got a little Chaz, yeah picture scrolls onto the screen more like a transition but whatever oh well, let's see if they have blowback and i was right to be afraid or if we're fine big bang they're just going for piercing i mean that's gonna hurt like hell but we got enough life points to take it we're getting decently low yes good job Chaz. okay you know what i did the right choice in the end i'm a genius all right ah back Oh, the last two cards in their hand were back row, really? Oh, interesting. I have a choice to make. Well, I'm making this no matter what. I did not do this for nothing. I summon G uh, Arm Dragon level 10. Yes, my boss monster. Better believe I'm going to use this effect. Arm Dragon level 10, obliterate. Screw a new hand. I don't need a new hand. I like my hand. The only way we safely win this is if I go in Jinzo. But screw safety, I'm all... I'm semi-in. We're not going to win this turn anyway. I'm semi-in. Just don't have Magic Cylinder. Okay, they just have Woboku. See? I didn't need Jinzo for that. We get to keep our Dragon level 10, which will literally be a Lightning Vortex forever, so... And on my, on my Putty's next turn, he could just Heavy Storm, so we're good. Okay. We're fine. 
We can go Arm Dragon level 10, just uh, Heavy Storm. I'm just sad my Arm Dragon level 10, I mean Arm Dragon level 5. I'm just sad level 10 didn't get to do anything. Okay, didn't want a Heavy Storm. Well, it turns out there was no need, so good job. At least set the Giant Trunade for me. I know I don't usually do that for you, but... Okay, well, let's hope they don't top deck anything. This is why I wanted you to set that. But I could just go Jinzo and keep things safe. Even though I do like Arm Dragon, Jinzo just guarantees safety, so... Let's go for guaranteed safety. Alright, Jinzo will guarantee the safety of us, and then I do 24. The only thing that could have stopped us there was the scapegoats. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna get a lot of money for this one, because I got to summon my boss monster. He got to summon his boss monster. We leveled up all over the place, and, uh, yeah, what are you gonna do against Jinzo with swords? Backing it up. You got a big hand, but that's all you got. So, they have one set card. What's your plan against one set card? A Sir Priest is probably a good idea. Heavy Storm? Yeah, I thought so. So what was their back row? Tweester and MST. Gotcha. I would say a Sir Priest, buddy, just because what if that's a floater card? Okay, it wasn't a floater, but it could have been. Eh, whatever. We won. That duel. That duel we won, and I got to be ballsy about it and just get my best, my, my favorite boss monster here for this deck. Whew, a little stressful. After that first duel, I was I was thinking it was going to be a bad day, but maybe we can make up for it. Our Dragon Level 10 bonus, 20 extra dollars. That's a lot of money that we desperately need. Yeah, you go replenish. Hey, we're done with Metal Shooter and his buddy. See, we're doing good, guys. We're doing good. Okay, I know I have to duel them eventually, but not now. I hate them. We got the ninjas already. It's these two. These two are going to be such a problem. If my partner is that stupid, we're in so much trouble. And all the AI plays the same, by the way, so don't pretend like you can just get another partner. The only thing you're actually changing is your deck. And to do that, you'd have to beat another character ten times, and I'm not doing that. Chaz is my partner. Going first with a mass Dragon is exactly what we wanted, and all this other stuff is just nice to have. So we'll have that ready. We'll have MST ready for their field spell, and we'll have Magic Cylinder ready. That is the ultimate play right there. So let's see if they get the field spell. I hope they do. That's fine too. Let this happen. You don't want to use your... Yeah, do not use your thing. Mass Dragon, don't worry. We have a combo with you. We're going to go ahead and use Mass Dragon. We're going to uh, get an Arm Dragon level 3 out. Arm Dragon level 3 is ready to go. We have some set cards that we can't really deal with. I mean, I can hit one of them. Let me just take a guess. I'm going to say this is the problem card. That could have been a problem card. We don't know yet. All right. Now, Chaz, you need to play this safe. So just go all in with Flying Kamakiri. Good. I like that. I agree with this. Yes. Good. We're going to evolve. All right. We're making it to Arm Dragon level 10. Now, just set one Mirror Force and one Rageki Break. Or two Regeki breaks. I'll take two. But I highly doubt the AI will do that. That's why I said the other way. Okay, we'll take it. We have the best back row in the game right now. We have the best front row in the game right now. We're, we're, we're looking good. We are looking good. A set. No field spell this time around. Well, let's uh, win the duel. How do I want to win this? Let's win it by... I think I win if I creature swap, so I want to Rageki Break the other thing, not the monster. Rageki Break, do not throw away this. Um, throw away your Heavy Storm. You don't need Heavy Storm. Pop that. Ah, so they have a Trap Stopper, which means we win the duel. If that's actually all they had. Even though we had the best traps in the game right now, then we win, because I could just do this. I summon my Giant Germ. We activate Creature Swap. We're going to Creature Swap Giant Germ. We get rid of Royal Magical Library. We're going to begin the Onslaught of Damage. We're going to attack for 14. This was to maximize our damage this turn. We do 500 burn, leaving them with 5,000 life points left. Alright, now we Special Summon two more Germs. We filled up our field for a maximum field bonus. We attack for 1,000. They will live by 200, but if they kill a single germ, we win, so... Even though we can't use our traps, our, the survival of our germs wins us the duel. Hell, if, if Chaz has Stamping Destruction, we win the duel. 
That was literally the best I could do. That was the most damage I could do in one turn. And I'm proud of myself. I don't care what anybody says. Alright, Chaz. I don't know how you messed this up. You literally just go in. You just go in and put a German defense. Okay, yeah. That way we can win by that too. Wall of Illusion doesn't matter. We want it to... Yeah, it's fine. That works. It's annoying that we lose on Dragon Level 7. Yes, but guess what? Flying Kamikiri wins us the duel. We got revenge. Perfect victory. 8,000 life points remaining. Um, they may have countered all the amazing traps we got, but it did not matter. We won too quickly. See, if I go first, I can get us started. I can really get us started. If I go second, we just get screwed over. Yeah, you guys better start dueling more. I want to wanna beat you guys. Get five victories. I already got five on them. Okay, if I already got five on them, we need to leave and come back. There they are again. Good. That's who we want. You too. Come here. I need five victories on you. We're unlocking new characters here, and you guys are in the way. Alright. I got myself fist. You got fist as well. Not bad. What about scissors? Haha, -ha, gotcha. Alright, now that I got them, we get to go first, and I can show off our advantage again. We're going first. Draw a bunch of cards. Not a good hand. We have one chance, and that's they don't blow up swords. Not a good hand. It, it's great that we have Arm Dragon level 10. You did not want to draw Arm Dragon level 7. That's my only level 7 in my deck, and it's right there. Alright, so they had no chance of stopping that, which means their traps are going to be a lot more painful. Since it's not Twister or anything. So, Stamping Destruction is a must. God, why run two Axe of Despairs when you don't even know how to use one? Do the people making this game not realize they didn't program the AI to use the freaking stuff? It's a possibility. I've, I've, I've seen it happen. Oh, Des Koala. You see, this is why we attack with the bigger monster. Is it because you think there's a trap card? It took a lot of burn there. 1600's an insane amount. Alright, we're going to make it to his boss form, and then I'll make it to my boss form. So we both get a summoning animation. His summoning animation is more of a Chaz animation. Boom, baby. Good job. Key card bonus. Alright, we got ourselves a set and some back row. It's one of those times I wish I had MST or something, but I have Breaker, and that's all I got. Oh, what a pity. Uh, well, I'm going to try summoning Breaker. I should just go for Armed Dragon level 10, but I feel like Breaker can do this. Uh, Breaker, will you... Oh, whoops. Wrong way. Uh, Breaker, will you break them? Yeah, I just don't want to deal with the trap card right now. Aha! And now we're going to special summon our Armed Dragon level 10. So, we did it again. We got our boss boy. Oh, beautiful. And now that we've gotten rid of the opponent, let's go all in. Let's just make sure they don't have Marshmallow on or something stupid that they use for tribute. Nope, just a 2k defender. I did say all in, so I might go all in, all in, but we'll see. Uh, Breaker, go first just in case. It's like another shrink or something. Okay, it's not a shrink. Or something worse. Flying Kamikiri, we do need your help. Let's get something powerful out here. The strongest thing we can get is Twin Head, then get me Twin Head. Twin head is the strongest. Okay, we got 4,500 damage showing. We're going to leave them bleeding and hurt. And saving call the haunted is the better play, but leaving them with no life points to use their field spell is still a good play. So I'm probably going to just go ahead and use call the haunted. Yeah. So this is just so they can't play the game. They can't use a lot of their spells, like no premature burial, no nothing. They're just going to have to live with it. Ah, it was Royal Decree. That makes a lot of sense. So we weren't going to be able to use the trap anyway. They could still summon one monster, but Arm Dragon level 10 is probably the most unbeatable monster in this particular duel against these particular opponents. Smashing Ground, I have such bad defense, you can't... Oh, no, it has 2,000. Arm Dragon level 7 has 1,000. Shit. Okay, well, it's fine. We have swords, and we have Arm Dragon level 5 in his hand. He could tribute for Arm Dragon level 5. Please get an MST or something. Shit. Okay, well, the problem here is that uh, new face don't fit. Oh, my God, we might have needed that. Yeah, we lost Arm Dragon, but it was worth it. We, we did it to win the duel. 
Oh, almost win. They're so close. They're so close. If he had only used Axe of Despair, but it's just, he does, they're just bricks. They're literal bricks in his hand. The game gave him intentional bricks. I can't believe you did this, Kona. No! Oh, okay, it's you. Sorry, I thought you were, uh... Yeah, I thought you were doing it to on our other guy. I forgot it's like you have to get rid of a fairy or something. Yep, now you see the problem. We're weaker than them. Uh, I run giant germ, so as long as I draw a germ, we win. I don't remember what my hand was. It's been a long time since my turn. Uh, let's see. Do I have a germ? I can get a germ. Oh, I drew one. <laughs> oh, that's nice. All right, I'm going to go ahead and attack. Yep, that's game. I love Giant Germ, guys. You you guys probably already noticed that. A lot of my loves influence a lot of things around my life, including my own tournaments. No need to special summon when we already won. Alright, we got another win on these guys. These guys are very scary, so anytime I get a win on them, I feel proud. We got lots of money. We, we did it. We did it. We got the money we needed. You're the victor. You are a capable one. Hey, better start dueling more. Yes, we did it! We never have to duel them again! Oh, thank God. Ha, you losers. Oh, I might as well open up a chest. I just want some extra money before I go buy packs. A card? You know what? That card's actually good. I'm not gonna lie. Anti-spell fragrance is good in certain decks. Nothing for what I need right now, so it's kind of bleh right now, but still good. So let's go ahead and buy some cards. We can see what the new structure deck is. It is... Ooh, Curse of Darkness. I don't really know that one at all. So, the structure, I mean, the d packs we're going to spend time on now. I still need this pack, sadly. Um, I still need this pack for one more. Eh, I don't really need it. I'll buy one. Uh, what's a pack I neglect? <clears throat> the Blue Eyes Ultimate Pack, I am neglecting that one. 72% is not right. It's doing worse than the regular Blue Eyes Pack, for crying out loud. Any other packs I'm neglecting? I can buy one more pack today. Okay, packs that don't suck. Maybe this pack. Let's try this one. Mother Earth. I love that we made just enough money to buy this many packs. It's a good pack buying day. Dream Clown! Good to see him. Always good to see him. First Dream of Destruction. Classic card. Uh, Luminous Spark's good. Defusion? Eh. Eh, I'm not that kind of a player. I am a Dream Clown player. You got me right. You got me there, game. You got me there. Cybertech Alligator. It's not a bad card, but it's not what we need. Thank you for giving me all the Dream Clowns, even though I already own all the Dream Clowns. I'm actually looking for a Bickery box if I can get one. DD Asylum is a good card, so it's good to have copies of it. Uh, let's see what else we can get. Threatening Roar, Kaitsu. Oh, okay. We have three now. Cool. All right. Well, we have three of those cards now. That's something we can live with. All right. I can't believe I never owned one of you, but still, you're like Cliff the Trap Remover, right? Extra Ganute and Card Trooper. I think I already have one. It's limited to one, so yeah. Oh, but don't worry. We got Grappler. <laughs> but we got the Grappler, though, so that's the important part. All right, guys. That's going to be it for this episode. I want to thank you all for watching. Next time, we might go back to Darkness since there's only a few characters we have to beat left. Or we might check out World Championship mode. Or there's one other thing I've been really wanting to do, which can unlock a huge event. But I've been saving it until I get enough cards to make a real deck. So I'll see you all then. Bye-bye, guys.